subscribe our channel for our new videos notifications so in this video we are going to discuss a really good and most hype project in this uh, coming week uh, so have a look on the website their project name is dead rejects the website link is deadrejects.com there are all the links regarding this project including their website their twitter page their tokenomics they are already mentioned in my video description you can check him out so have a look on the website there are some types uh, have a look on their uh, first have a look on their about their introduction they started out as a normal dudes uh, listen to music uh, did their own shit but you know how life goes the depression and anxiety gets a bit much for these guys it was uh, too much to handle they needed an escape a place without all this real world crap where all of them could do whatever the hell they wanted without feeling the way they did before that's where dates come in uh, and their last hope made for rejects by rejects this is uh, a small introduction about this project so have a look on the showcases some um, sneak peeks are uh, this might be a legendary mythic sneak peek of this one have a look on their roadmap just got rejected launch meant for their rejected members meant uh, like they're whitelisted the rejected is their tag for the whitelisted peoples claiming their genesis reject to access the afterwards any remaining supply uh, of the dead rejects is moved to a public sale yes uh, if uh, the uh, whitelist people did not mend uh, till get sold out then remaining supply will be goes to their public mint then life after rejection all rejects enter the afterwards the private holder launch yes there will be a holder verification if you're holding the nft then you can verify it by connecting the wallet to the uh, verification system then reject DAO uh, formation then we will be a part of the DAO exclusive decision making process to make sure holders have the ability to help facilitate and lead the project hope of survival they are going to launch their dead tokens also then each reject on seven dead per day there will be a staking system also 90k usd from mint revenue will go to their liquidity pool the lifeblood of the afterwards dead in this phase rejects can upgrade themselves by minting undeads undeads will act as a multiplier and offer higher stacking rewards to holders in this phase all unmitted supply will be burned there will be a chant too also name as undeads the end of the beginning we plan to keep building out greater utilities for our ecosystem for holders as our ecosystem expands we plan to add more benefits to users who hold all three rejects dead and undead and females this is gonna be a huge one there are more roadmap bigger roadmap will be there after completing this roadmap then here we go for the rejectionomics rejectionomics <laughs> this is called as uh tokenomics in our language so have a look there is a dead token ded -E the rejects are addicted to feeding on dead the hunt for it in the afterwards without dead's rejects begin to fade away their utility token their supply is 3939 <clears throat> their supply uh their price of the genesis reject can be minted for 1.75 solana which is a fair one as compared to their hype have a look on their basic questions uh they have set their launch date at 16th april 2022 secondary marketplace magic eden deads are the core of their entire ecosystem in-depth information is available in the rejectionomics have a look on the team their uh, team is well known karthik merotra is a project lead Gary Conway, financial advisor, Juan Art, D director, Ratan Kapoor, head of strategy, Braham Myra is a ma marketing manager. Uh, become a reject, you can join them on the Twitter and Discord to get rejected role, means a whitelist role. 
I will look on the rejectonomics. The, this links also already mentioned here uh, in my video description. So 70% is reserved for the stacking rewards and liquidity pool. 16% goes to the core team minimum one year of vesting period. 13 uh, percent is an administrated for marketing and collaboration related. 1% is put towards giving back to ones in need through a charitable donation. And all this information regarding the tokenomics are already mentioned here. The roadmap also I just follow them on the Twitter. They have really good followers, 21k followers and 4k around supply. Which is gonna be a huge one. They recently um, did a collab with uh, Onira, which is also a good project. Which is gonna be a huge one also. So have a look. They are getting really good response in their giveaways of whitelist spots. Also do your own research. Nerds, also a good project. They're doing really good collabs and expect so some good returns from this so i believe you will get whitelisted there are still whitelisting is going ongoing and more than 100 spots are open to for the community so try to get in and just uh, there are recently they have started the wallet collection through a mercury uh, of blocksmith labs this also a good project I hope you holding the blocksmith labs. They just implemented the Rafa system through fork token. So I hope you enjoy this video. Please click on 